Hi everyone, today I am going to show you how to fuse or do the image registration using the 3D Slicer software medical imaging. So what, what you have to do is you have first you have to open your software 3D Slicer. So this is the interface uh, that you have. Then you want to load your data set image. You have to go to the data here. And then you have two choice to load your data. First, direct to the directory. And then second one is direct to the file that you have to load. Okay, uh, I have been load my data set. So I just direct to the DCM, this one. So all the data set that I have load before uh, will be in my folder in 3D Slicer folder at C program. Okay. So choose your data set. Uh, I just demonstrate uh, the simple one of the Nema Phantom. So this is my Phantom uh, Akmal validation this name and then I have two series description one is the CT from the CT image the second one is the set of spec imaging so this is the modality so if you can see this is the size of that image this is the number of count and this is the date what you added the data set in your folder of in 3D slicer Okay, if you want to choose one, will be appear just one image data set. So if you choose both of the city and spec, so both will be in your loaded data. Okay, and then you have to choose uh, both of the data and then you have to select your program here. Uh, this, this is the just uh, default that you have. Uh, don't uh, change anything. So you have to examine it and then the processing of the multi volume importer plugin. So the data that come here. So the, this is the reader and this is the warning if the error will be pop up in your 3D slicer. So load it. Okay. Just, run, just uh, click OK and the loaded data will be in your note. Okay, this one is your CT data. This one is your spec imaging data. So, you can see here if you unable to see your data will be unvisib invisible in your uh, interface. Okay, so I want to uh, see my CT first. So, I select my CT first. So if you want to, if I want to see my spec imaging, so I select my data set spec of imaging. Okay, so you can up and down to increase, to minimize or maximize your image. Okay, you can scroll it until the whole of your data set. Okay, let's go. We do the image registration. Uh, and you have to pick up one of the parameters. This is the registration. Uh, there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight of that method of registration. So the common uh, that I use is the landmark registration. And then there is two uh, choice you have to choose. Uh, the first one is fixed volume and the second one is the moving moving volume. So it's up to you. If you want to choose the CT one for the fixed volume, it can. Then you have to choose the second one for the moving volume. And of course, we have to select the spec imaging. Okay. If you want to change, the spec is as fixed and the city as a moving volume also can. Okay, proceed to apply. And then automatically this system of 3D slicer image registration will register your image of spec and city. 
Okay, that one, this one is the city. Okay. Uh, A S T I T R. Okay, this one, uh, sorry, this is the spec imaging. This is a city, that moving one. Then this is the transform of your image registration. So what I want to do is uh, I just want to see the transform one. And I, uh, I can choose the display image. Is it you want to fix moving or transform? Okay, uh, I just want to see the transform after the registration. I want to see the layout as a uh, uh, Excel viewer. So you can put this one of the scroll bar. Okay, if you can see, this is the first spear, second spear, third spear, fourth spear, fifth spear, and sixth spear. Okay, I want to minimize little of my image. Okay, it looks like uh, cannot distinguish uh, between the spec and city image. So you can uh, change the contrast of your transform image. So you have to uh, choose your active volume. So you have next one. This is the city. This this is the uh, your spec imaging and the third one is this is your fusing between city and spec imaging so you can look up the table that uh, you want to choose uh, usually i choose the internal of my image volume contrast okay Okay, you can uh, change the contrast with label or label of your contrast. I want to choose the okay. This one of my image registration, I just use there. Okay, it look like better from before I uh, change their contrast. So you can uh, you can see this is the my city, and this is my spec imaging. So the registration is complete, and uh, what we call uh perfect registration between two image of spec and city okay uh, you can uh, try another data set patient or the nema phantom also okay and then if you want to do the uh, the segmentation of that image in your nema sphere you can add let's say i want to Calculate the spear one, spear one, and then I rename it as a spear one. So always I use the pet tumor segmentation. Even the accuracy of the pet tumor segmentation is not higher for the image uh, spec imaging. So never mind. I just uh, want to show for you how to uh, do the segmentation of that my image so this is my image so i want to plus surface it make as a master so look like better so their shape is like a sphere so if you can if you can see the volume of that uh, segmentation, you can go to the quantification and then segment statistic. And then you have to apply. Okay, and then, so the volume is 28 centimeter. Uh, 